Hello everyone, I'm back at Fallout 4, finally. I am leaving, or I'm starting right where I left off. I have a new hard drive, and this is my third try doing this, so hopefully my commentary will be good. It's been a week or two since I played, so hopefully I'm ready to play this again. It is getting annoying playing the same thing over and over again, though. So hopefully this time, now that I have a new hard drive, my video will actually save, and I can go ahead and upload it right after this. Now, let's talk to Dad. Yes, Doctor, I'm taking all my little pills. Yes, thank you, Doctor. I think that will be all for now. But I haven't quite finished. I believe we're done now. Thank you. Yes, sir. Thank you. I understand mass fusion was a success, despite interference from the Brotherhood of Steel. The job is done. That's what matters. For the moment, yes. The Brotherhood's intervention must be placed in a larger context, however, given their penchant for hoarding technology. Future conflict with them is guaranteed. We are, after all, keepers of the most advanced technology in the Commonwealth, if not beyond. It also cannot go unnoticed that there were concerns within the Institute about your allegiances. I, of course, never doubted your commitment to our cause, but by directly confronting the Brotherhood, I think you've put some others at ease. I'm proud of you, regardless. The Brotherhood is an issue for the future, and we must focus on the present. And look at me, rambling on like the old man I am. I'm wasting time. You're needed elsewhere at once. Whatever it is, I can take care of it. I certainly hope so. This situation, I'm afraid, is something of your creation, however unintentional. Oh, I remember what if this is. I've done something to jeopardize the Institute. All right. I'll fix it. You have my word. I have no doubt that you will. But it's nothing quite so dire. While you were assisting Dr. Fillmore, a second team was sent out to... invite someone from the Commonwealth to join the Institute. Apparently, there was some miscommunication, and this individual called for help, which arrived in the form of your Minutemen. My understanding is that no shots have been fired. I would like it to stay that way. I need you to go there, and speak to your Minutemen gathered outside. Insist that they stand down at once. Dr. Thompson is on site, and he will be your primary contact. I know you can resolve the situation. But it is of paramount importance that this special individual be brought to the Institute immediately. They'll listen to me. I'll figure something out. You can consider this handled. Believe me, I already do. Okay, this is a, uh, a simple task they just gave me, you know? Let's go do it, yeah. Uh... Not going to be angry with the Minutemen. That should prove useful in your surface missions. Not now. Don't need anything at the moment. At this point, I'm honestly considering going with another ending. Eh, no, no, I'm gonna finish this the way that I started it, uh, or at least the way that I planned to at first with the Institute. Even though this is my third time getting that ending. The load time seemed a little better. On my new hard drive. That's pretty nice. All right, let's see what's yeah. up. What's going on here? You're an unexpected surprise. We could use the backup. These Institute bastards aren't getting away. They'll have to go through us to get out of there. We don't know quite what we're up against, but it's good you're here to help. How did you hear about this? I can't believe you thought this was a valuable use of time and resources. Are you kidding me? The Institute is clearly trying to kidnap a Commonwealth citizen. Again! And you're saying we shouldn't be here? I thought our whole purpose was to protect the people. To stop shit like this from happening. So, 
How do you want to play this? We thought about trying to lure him out here, since it'd be easier to kill him. But then we realized we probably ought to storm the place, to make sure they can't disappear on us. That makes sense, right? So, you want to lead the charge? Have your men hold their ground. I'll go in and assess the situation. I don't think that's a good idea. Sir, we have to act now, or else we risk not only letting them get away, but taking one of ours with them. I wouldn't wish that fate on anyone. Are you gonna lead us in there, or what? You'd risk that man's life? You could get him killed too. If we don't do anything, he's as good as dead. Are you so against this? You do know which side you're on, don't you? You sure you're willing to risk being wrong about this? I'm tired of risking things. Oh, I'm God tired damn it. of risking lives. And that's why I'm not letting them take this guy. If you're not with us, then you best get the hell out of here before we take you down as one of them. General. Why don't I just go inside and talk to them? But now this seems like the proper solution. Because they're not going to storm in. You're supposed to be defusing the situation. Get out there and Dude. do it. I'm not going to kill them. God fuck. Ah, last time it worked perfectly fine. Oh shit. Uh If I wouldn't have walked inside, I would have been fine. All right. Oh god damn it. Ah. No, I can't turn against I cannot turn against the Minutemen. Well, you know what? I'll go back. And we'll just uh resume at this spot. So yeah, see you in a few minutes. Moving in or what? Well, what do you know about the person who lives here? Uh, not too much. Wallace is. We've checked in on him every now and then. Did not mean he didn't to seem to want the one. company. So, we moving in or what? Gonna stand a ground. Have your men hold their ground. I'll go in and assess the situation. I don't think that's a good idea, <coughs> sir. We have to act now, or else we risk. Mm -hmm. Are you gonna lead us? In? Okay. You'd risk that man's life? You could. If we don't do right. you so again. See, this always works before, because this is the fourth fucking you time sure I've done you're this. Willing to risk being wrong about this? Look, I, there we go. I just want people to be safe, you know? I don't want anyone else dying or getting kidnapped or whatever. We won't start shooting or nothing. But you, you better get in there. And make sure you're right. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna fix this situation gonna walk in there and fix it right up with these hella awesome loading screens they aren't taking nearly as long as they used to because this hard drive is faster oh thank god you're here I was starting to worry we might not make it out of this mess let's focus on getting back I couldn't agree more I know he's potentially important to Phase 3 and all, but I'm not sure it's worth putting ourselves in harm's way. If he's really important to the Institute, then it's worth it. You're right, I suppose. I know they've been keeping an eye on him for years. Not sure how they originally found him, but probably don't want to know. But once they realized how smart he was and what an asset he could be for Phase 3, they watched pretty closely. I think they even fed him scientific material from time to time to see how good he was, you know, testing him to see if he was institute material. Let's just get Wallace and get out of here. No argument from me. Let's go. Right. There's just, well, there's a slight problem with that. He doesn't want to go with us. I was thinking, maybe you could try and talk to him. I guess I'll have to. Since you're useless. I think that's a little unfair. Well shit, I hit the wrong key. Damn, now I sound like an asshole. 
useless. Mr. Wallace, I'm here to talk to you. You're another one of, uh, of them, aren't you? Are you a robot? I mean you no harm. No one here does, all right? We're just here to talk. You're not stealing my organs, or shooting me into space, or whatever it is you do. I won't let you. I've heard all the stories. I know exactly what happens to people when the Institute shows up. Well, it's not happening to me. These are some terrible fucking choices. Hey, just calm down, okay? I know the I talk to you. other two I don't work. Talk, I wouldn't be in here. Now just, just go away! Sarcastic and convincing don't work, just so... shut up and listen to me. We're not here to hurt you. But if you make this difficult, you're going to regret it. See? I knew it! You're here to kill me. Okay, look, we're out of time. Yeah, we are. Institute. This is Dr. Thompson. I'm sorry, I'm gonna need a. Oh, he's got some papers. Days, it? He's got a table full of fucking bones. Got some crab. Got a fucking toaster. Outside, but we have to get this man back to report, to sir. I expect Father will want a report from you. You must be pretty excited. Next director. Yeah, sure I am. Let's see, what do you got here that I could oh you could use that? Yeah, take all this guy's shit. He isn't gonna need it anymore. He's been abducted by the Institute. That means they're gonna be, do shitty things like test him now, right? Okay, now back to the institute. Institutitude. What do you mean I cannot fast travel? They just beam did. Oh come on. The institute teleports, not fast travels. There we go. Okay, let's go talk to, uh, son. Father is son. Ah, there you are. I cannot express how pleased I am. Our new guest is familiarizing himself with his surroundings. Yet he's already pointed out several inefficiencies in our methods. With his help, phase three will be ready in no time. And it's all thanks to you. A lot of work went into this before I even arrived. Just how close are we? It shouldn't take long at all. The facilities division has it well in hand. There is one more part for you to play. And I think you might enjoy it. It is time to announce our presence to the Commonwealth. To request that they do not interfere with our plans. You should be the one to do it. That's a good idea. Hopefully we can prevent violence and save some lives. Yes, that is one goal. And if you are to be the new director of the Institute, you should be the one to do it. We've prepared some remarks for you to record. Once you're finished, we'll broadcast them to the entire Commonwealth. Use the microphone here and follow the script. It's quite simple. I'm sure you'll do fine, Father. For years now, you have suspected that the Institute still exists. That we are among you. It is true. But it is not the whole truth. We're here. And we are. Here to help. Our superior technology represents the future of the Commonwealth. Today, we activate our nuclear reactor. Ensuring that we will persevere long after the world above ground ceases to exist. Ensuring that mankind has a future. We have no desire to interfere in the unimportant details of your... ...pathetic existences. 
We simply insist that you do not interfere with Institute operations. To do so would result in tragedy for all involved. Rest easy. Know that the future is in safe hands and that mankind will thrive under our guidance. That's weird. It like, like it changed the no, microphone at the last second. Interesting. Perhaps not what we originally intended, but it will certainly get your point across. Now it's time to make sure that everyone hears it. How would you feel about making a little trip to Diamond City? Sure thing. I'll go if it's necessary. It absolutely is. The radio station in Diamond City is uh, listened to by many every time in the I'm gonna record my If we'd like the people to hear what stops we have to working say, correctly. It's the best way to reach them. Before we preempt their broadcasts, we need to ensure it reaches the maximum range possible. I've been assured that the necessary parts are on site. You'll just need to install them to boost the broadcasting power. Report back when you're done. We should be ready by then. Okay. Reconfigure the transmobobulator. To Diamond City we go. Uh, this one is probably going to take a little while to load. Big place, man. Big place. But actually, it didn't take very long at all. Huh? Hmm. I must trade for all Diamond City right here. Hey, Thirsty. Swatta, 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 swatta. Swing, swatta. Need some custom hardware? We got a free workbench for all your motor. Okay, so we're gonna Is this water radioactive? Nope. That's good. I found this album on Reddit. There was a whole bunch of locations that are in the game than in real life compared. Yep, that is radioactive. Much longer if we don't get a move on. Interesting. But, uh, um, it's pretty interesting. Hi. There. Hmm. That's mine now. Okay. Okay, so over here I think we got, uh, the one with dials. Here we got the one with buttons. And here we got the one with dials. This goes here. That was the one with tubes. This is why. This is why. I will end you, bitch. Nah. Nah, I'm gonna be a good person today and not attack him. Those are mine now, too. Okay, now we're gonna travel back to the Institute. So, here we go. Lots of fast traveling and not much else. Lots of floating screams and dialogue. But hey, at least I know exactly what my character is going to say. At this point, I could easily get a mod for it. I just haven't just yet. This is getting dark. What, I step into a vault? This doesn't even look like it's in the Institute anymore. Looks like an old, dated, dusty vault entrance. All right, let's go turn on a fusion reactor. All 
All right, son. Let's do the thing. Enjoy your trip to the big city. It's done then. The transmitter has been modified. Everything is in place. It's ready to go when we are. Good. Once the reactor is online, we'll cut into their broadcast. I'll let you do the honors. This, my friends. Okay. The moment we've all worked. After all here your we effort, go. The time is finally what happens if I stand in here for a no second? No longer will we be forced to compromise to survive. Oh, that's so cool. No more. It's will just like an actual fusion reactor on the inside. Our resources. My father and I couldn't be more proud of what you have helped all us. All right. And we look forward. So, let's uh, start it up. To achieving even greater things in the future. The Institute is now truly mankind's... That got radioactive fast. What if I go on top of it? Yep, that's, uh, that's still radioactive. Still radioactive. Okay, so we did the thing. That's awesome. Son. It's almost hard. God, that's still so weird. After all those years of hard work, here we are. We've arrived. Look what you've made possible. I did good work, didn't I? Yes. Yes, you did. There's more work to be done before the Institute's future is guaranteed. The Directorate has convened a meeting about how to proceed. I'm not going to attend. You should be there as Director. All right, so we will meet with the boss people. They're just like me, except I'm the head boss. They're the uh, they're the people below me that do what I say. Cause I'm the boss. I just did a 420 no scope. Yep. Does this get rid of radiation? does. That's awesome. I really needed that. I'm also uh, just gonna borrow all that stuff I just picked up. I'm sorry if the commentary isn't as good. It's just <coughs> quite difficult doing this three times and finding something different to say every time or sounding enthusiastic about you know, I love my work, saying the same but thing. I love being a father even more. All this advanced technology, okay. and we still can't cure the Last beam. Just gonna bug out at the door, I guess. Take good care of yourself, and you won't have to see too much. Don't tell me what the Remember fuck to, to do. Practice good sanitation habits at all times. What they? There wouldn't be any germs down. There'd have to be sub germs. How did they build this? Operating at full capacity. Like part of this had to be here. Before the war. Sounds like those I like how everything is so shiny and slick and that's boom. My power number. Well, no, really. How did this get here? They did not build this after the war. Because there was... There'd be no way. Remember to conserve power at every opportunity. We have a fusion reactor now. We could do as we please. And what's with these red lights? And when do they ever go off? From what I hear, that rogue sent that Libertalia is a real menace. May I be the first to welcome you, sir. We're looking forward to working with you. I hope so. Before you weren't. Alright, let's get this going. I'm happy to be here, Dr. Fillmore. I hope I do the position justice. I'm sure you will. Right now, we're all here because it's finally time to stand up for ourselves. Let's not be dramatic, Justin. There's nothing dramatic about it. We're in a position to push back, to assert ourselves here. That's what we've talked about all along. To bring you up to speed, obviously there are groups in the Commonwealth that stand in opposition to the Institute's goals. With the reactor now online, we have the ability to not only expand synth production, but to project power to a much greater degree. I'm sure the reactor will improve everyone's life. It's a great accomplishment. Yes, but it's not just that. The Directorate has agreed that steps must be taken to ensure our safety in the long run. Let's not beat around the bush. The Directorate has agreed that the Brotherhood of Steel 
needs to be eliminated. As the incoming director, we felt it important to inform you of the decision and get your thoughts on it. So, where do you stand? I agree. We hit them hard, before they have time to react to our new position. Good. That's just what I wanted to hear. As director, it's up to you and how we focus our efforts in achieving this goal. We'd like your input on what direction we should take. Do we increase synth production or focus on weapons development? Synths are the Institute's greatest strength. The more we have, the better off we are. Well said. I'll see that the necessary steps are taken. Thank you very much for your time, sir. That's all we have for the moment. I believe Father wished to speak with you once our meeting concluded. To be frank, I don't agree with Father's decision, but I'll accept it. You know what, Dr. Lee? You could go fuck Unit yourself. Is undergoing the reclamation right on back to, uh... Before long, he'll be back in the Right on back to, uh, that place, yeah. <laughs> Where I saw you the first time. God damn it. Oh, Washington, D.C., the capital wasteland. Good to see you. Madison Lee could go fuck herself right back to the capital wasteland. Actually, I need to check something real quick. Alright, so... This is actually recording, which is an awesome thing. Because, yeah. When it does a record, it sucks ass. You know, if it hadn't been for that recording bug, I could be doing so much more of the game right now. Ah, there you are. You've met with the director. I assume they made their intentions known? It was difficult for them to reach the decision to engage in open hostility. What about you? Do you agree with their decision? It's the only way we can ensure the Institute's safety. That makes it the right thing to do. I'm glad you agree. None what comes next will be easy. That conviction may help keep us all going. You know, Father, it's no secret that you worked with the Railroad in order to first reach the Institute. The depth of your involvement with them has been called into question repeatedly. I'm sure you can guess by whom. The question is, where do you stand with them now? Do you count them amongst your allies? They mean nothing to me. Never have. I'll admit, I'm relieved to hear that. Then I certainly hope I can count on you for what needs to be done. Because these fanatics cannot be allowed to continue to exist. They represent a very clear threat to the Institute. Small as they are in number, their twisted ideology ensures that they will never stop trying to strike at us. They must be eradicated. Are you willing to see to it? You don't have to worry about them any longer. They're as good as dead. Thank you. Do what needs to be done, but keep yourself safe. Going to wreck them. Okay, so now we need to head over there and uh, if you require maintenance, fuck them up. But first, we're gonna take a look at the shop and uh, see if they got anything for us. After we check in here to make sure there's nothing new, and there isn't. Okay. We are honored to welcome you here. Oh. We don't usually welcome outsiders. I hope you can appreciate your good fortune. Hi. Welcome. Do you require additional supplies? I do. Barter with me, bitch. I'll take a look, sure. Okay. What do I have to get sell to you? Nothing there. Nothing there. Huh. I thought I had some really valuable stuff last time I played through this. What did I have that I got so much money from? Am 
might have been ammo. We'll do all of that. Not that. See, if I could sell it off, then that did not work how I was planning. Shit. Ah, fuck it. Cancel. I can't. Uh, I need more money. All right. Well, anyways, we have nice to go. Bringing that rogue synth back. We have to go deal with the railroad because at the moment I do not have enough caps to buy more stuff. So, oh my, my armor is damaged. I'll fix it after I'm done. Wrecking them. Time to get derailed, bitch. Carrington wants to talk with you. What? What was that? Carrington wants to what? Uh, Fuck you. Find him. <sighs> Whoops. I accidentally uh Move, slipped. Oh, I'm out of grenades, and that gun's actually doing it. I'm not out of grenades, they were selected, you dumb fuck. Okay, so we're gonna go with some Psycho. Some Tato, because it gives health. And, yeah. Grenades. Lots of grenades. Oh god damn, it's crawling. That actually made me feel kinda bad. Oh. Okay, well now uh, there's a whole bunch of things to loot here. So... That was it. Actually. Hey. Just let me know. Piper. You know, you look like you could really use this. These things have literally saved my life. Your thoughts? I suppose this was always how it was going to end for the railroad, wasn't it? No one faces down the Institute and lives. Okay. That was all I had. Okay. So... I'm going to loot this place. And, uh, continue recording afterwards. I have no idea what that clicking is, and it's driving me insane. So yeah, be right back. Alright, so I finished looting. Now we're going back to the Institute to talk to Dad. Exactly like I was supposed to. I'm a good robot that does what he's told. How much? Okay. This is going to be a short episode. But not by much, honestly. Because I got a lot done. The work is done. I am sorry. I know it was likely difficult for you. Nah. Nope. Not a problem at all. I regret that it came to this, even if you don't. There was just no way to compromise with those people. There is obviously one final threat the Institute faces. Whatever it is, we can handle it. I believe so. But in this case, what matters most is how we handle it. The Brotherhood of Steel covets technology. 
and has made it clear that we cannot peacefully coexist. They will eventually come for us and attempt to take what we've spent so long creating. We need to destroy them before they can destroy us. You're right. We take the fight to them. I'm glad you agree. But the problem with the Brotherhood of Steel goes beyond the edges of the Commonwealth. It's not enough to destroy them here. There are more of them out there in the world, Father. And they too will come for us. We can defeat them now, we can defeat them again, if we have to. Possibly, yes. But it would be smarter to put an end to it now. We will show them that if they interfere with us, the very technology they value so highly will be turned against them. We will teach them that we can appear at a moment's notice, wherever we please, and they cannot ever stop us. They will know better than to ever interfere with us again. You seem pretty convinced this will work. The Institute is nothing if not thorough. Dr. Lee should be expecting you in her lab. She can fill you in on the details. Time is of the essence. Alright, so thank you all for watching. And check back tomorrow for the final episode. Have a good day.